Hello, Richie V here, and today I'm back with another nostalgia reaction. Now, nostalgia reaction is where I look back at something with rose tinted glasses to see if it still holds up today. Now, the song I'm looking at is called I'm Under Your Spell from the Buffy season six episode called Once More with Feeling. Now, I actually took a couple notes because I've been sort of winging it the first two of these I did, and I keep forgetting to say stuff. Oh, so when I talk about uh, that this episode is kind of a masterpiece, um, that's because it could have just been a fun one-off. That's what this show could have been, where they say, hey, let's do something different, and let's have everybody sing and dance. Instead, they use it to, to move this story, this, these plot lines along. Uh, when I looked this up, this is, um, once more with feeling is the seventh uh, episode. That means we're transitioning from the first third into the meat of, of the season. And up to this point, everybody has a secret. There's something bothering them. They're keeping it uh, to themselves. They're keeping it close to the vest. What happens in this episode is it all comes out. You know, they're not just singing, dancing. They're in these songs, they're telling these truths that they don't want anybody to know, but it comes out in the form of a song to the point where it's called Once More with Feeling because of the singing and dancing. However, it could uh, be called Truth and Consequences. That's what it could have been titled because the truth comes out in this episode and it leads to the, the meat, like I said, the meat of this season. So episode 19, Seeing Red, I'm not going to say what happens. I'm not going to spoil that part of it. Seeing Red is the other turning point. That's when you get into the big climax of the season where we find out who the true big bad is of the season. So in season six, they were going to make it um, a little lighter, a little more fun, which is how they came up with the trio, I believe. I could see the wheels spinning in their heads where it's uh, Warren, Jonathan, and uh, Tucker's brother. No, I, I know it's Andrew. Anyway, the point is that they decided to do that. But in, uh, see, in episode 19, Seeing Red, whew, we find out who the big bad is and, of the season, and it is uh, devastating. <laughs> but this is the first turn. This uh, Once More With Feeling is the first turn. And this big secret that's going on here is that Tara is worried that Willow is using magic too much. They start using, in this season anyway, they start using magic as a form of addiction. Willow is starting to use magic the way some people might use drugs. Uh, she's overdoing it. It is affecting her. It is affecting the people around her and she's starting to become dangerous. Instead of changing her ways, what Willow does is, uh, spoiler, uh, spoiler, sorry. <laughs> Instead of changing her ways, what Willow, Willow does is puts a spell on Tara, right? A and making her forget. So Tara doesn't remember the big argument and, uh, and her worries about Willow using magic too much. So, um, this song has two meanings. I'm under your spell means one thing. It means that, um, you know, when you're in love, you're under a spell. But it also has a second meaning. Tara is literally under Willow's spell. And, that, and that's why this song is kind of a genius because it has the, those two meanings. And it also uh, explores that idea of what's going on with Willow let's just watch this I'll have some more to say uh, when this is over do we have any books at all at home well who wants to be cooped up on a day like this the sun is shining there's songs going on those guys are checking you out what <laughs> what, what are they looking at yeah. the hotness of you do this boys really thought I was hot entirely oh my god I'm cured <laughs> I want the boys <laughs> fight to keep you because I'm not large with the butch I'm just not used to that they, they, they were really looking at me and you can't imagine what they see in you I know exactly what they see in me you I live my life in shadow never 
the sun on my face It didn't seem so sad though I figured that was my place Now I'm bathed in light Something just isn't right I'm under your spell How else could it be? Anyone would notice me It's magic I hate pause this, but I, I'm going to pause it. One. I'm not going to stop it again and just say, wow. I'm, I'm glad they let Amber Benson, who plays Tara, shine and get, get her moment in the sun. I'm under your spell. Nothing I can do. You just took my soul with you. You worked your job so well. Finally, I knew. Great shot. I bet they're not even working. <laughs> <sighs> okay, that was it. That was Amber Benson, who plays Tara on Buffy, uh, singing I'm Under Your Spell, the song with two meanings. Um, the one thing you'll notice, I mean, it was beautifully shot. And, and then there was that the whole thing where she is almost like a fairy tale, uh, where uh, you know where the, the sparkles come out. And... Uh, but as the song goes uh, goes on, there's uh, at the end, especially there's quite a bit of innuendo. I'm pretty sure they did that on purpose. I'm not sure if they're like trying to sly slyly get over on the network. This is the '90s um, or early 2000s, and a lot of the um, relationships, like uh, woman on woman relationships, were sort of censored at that time. So I, I guess maybe they were. Uh, purposely uh, being uh, using innuendo uh, but at the same point it it kind of went beyond in, innuendo um at some point where it, it wow you know what was i have i wrote down the lyrics um i break with every swell lost in ecstasy spread beneath my willow tree <laughs> yeah so definitely some innuendo in that song uh she's floating uh, which is a representation of ecstasy, I think. I think for a lot of people, uh, Willow and Tara is their favorite uh, relationship in Buffy the Vampire Slayer. I would only add, in, in my case, um, I really like the Zan Xander Anya one. Um, I'm going to say a spoiler here. So if you haven't seen past at uh, this point, um, I was really, really spoiler disappointed when they broke up Sandra and Anya that that was is it wasn't as devastating as as seeing red was and for those of you who watched the season know what I'm talking about the episode seeing red but it was a very for me uh, that one and I think there's their song is coming up uh, I'm, I'm not sure if I'm going to do it today though so that this was it Amber Benson got to shine what a great voice she had, um, and she was dancing so real well too. They had the backup dancers <laughs> come in, 
And yeah, just uh, excellently done as always. If you enjoyed it, hit like or subscribe, yada, yada, yada. And until I see you next time, have a blessed day.